Hello everyone and welcome to this channel. My name is Natalia and today we're gonna discuss about SDLC which stands for Software Development Lifecycle. What does it mean? What stages it has? And why it's important if you are trying to build your career as a software tester? And what do you need to know? And this channel is built for those who would like to start their career as a software tester or already working as a tester and would like to learn something new. If you guys have any topics you would like me to make videos about, please leave it in the comments below. Software Development Lifecycle or SDLC define the stages of building software application. Let's say you need to build a web application, then what steps you need to go through in order to complete it and deliver to the end users. There are seven stages of SDLC. The first one is a project planning. Second one is requirements gathering. Third one is design. Fourth is coding or development. Fifth is testing. Sixth one is production. And the last one is maintain. Let's start with the first phase, which is project planning. In this stage, clients or stakeholder and product owners meet together and they discuss about the project, what needs to be built, what are the view of the client, how they want to see this product. Let's say it's a web application for some services. What kind of services this web application needs to have? What kind of main functionality? So it's going to be a main plan where we need to move on to deliver the final product. Next stage is requirement gathering. That means now we know what we want, but we need to describe each function more details. We need to create requirements. If you work in waterfall methodology, it will call requirements. If you work in agile methodology, it will call user stories. We need to write all these requirements. We need to create them. And the results of this requirement gathering should be the backlog with requirements requirements where all functionality or the most of main functionality are described. After we have our requirements, we move to the design stage. In design stage, we have technical designers and designers team who are going to design how that product will work. From technical perspective, will be decided what tools needs to be used in order to build the final product. From UI UX perspective, they're going to be designers who are going to design look and feel of that web application functionality, how it's going to look like they will be set up a rules of design. Once this stage is complete, then we're gonna have coding or development stage. This is where developers comes on board. They will start to build functionality. They will start to write the code and move this code from one environment to another environment. Developers build their code based on the requirement in order to deliver final product to the end client. After developers deploy the code, then next stage is testing where software tester role will come on board. The testers will be testing each new functionality also based on the requirements and make sure that actual results are matching expected results. And if there are any defects found, there will be log defects and developer will be fixing them. After the project is tested and all defects are fixed, then we're gonna move to the next stage, which is production. That's mean we release our product to the end client. And the last stage of SDLC process is maintains. We want to make sure that our application is stable for end users. And if there are any defects, found by end users, they're gonna come back to us and we're gonna fix them because we wanted to maintain the quality of our product. We want to make sure all missed defects are fixed during this maintenance stage. Why it's important to know for a software tester? Because we are part of this process, we are part of the testing stage, and we need to understand how these stages are going from top to bottom and what role we are bringing into this process. And that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching my videos and hope to see you next time.